my project my project is designed to help children with their education issues, particularly children with chronic illness and disabilities. And um, we represent children who go to Children's Healthcare of Atlanta. And we, the Health Law Partnership helps with everything. We help with divorce, SSI, Medicaid, but I help just with education issues, such as helping my clients get IEP plans in place, helping them get 504 plans in place for their disabilities. So a lot of my clients have diabetes, sickle cell, um, some of them are quadriplegic, um, some of them are dying from cancer, and they need services, and the school may just not be providing them or don't know what services are appropriate for them. So I jump in and I help them. And the reason that um, I wanted to do this fellowship and was because I used to be a teacher. I have a bachelor's degree and a master's in education. And I worked in the inner city schools. And I had one particular child who had a brain tumor. And she uh, I was a second grade teacher. And she came to my class for about two weeks. And then she never came back. And so I assumed she dropped out, and they just forgot to take her name off my roster. I just didn't know what happened to her. I was a first-year teacher at 30 students, and I was like, okay, she's just not coming anymore. Six months later, she came back. And she came back, and she sat in my class, and I was like, why is she back in my class, and where has she been? And I talked to the mother, and she had, she had, brain, she had a brain tumor, and they had to operate on it. She was going through chemotherapy. And the school knew about it, but never told me. And um, so she came back to take her standardized exams, and I never knew. And so basically at that point it was too late. She had to take these exams, never went to school, never got any services. And um, and I'm, I don't know what the results of that exam were because I left the school that year, but I'm pretty sure she didn't do very well. And so that was one of my motivations to go to law school, was to help children like her who don't have a voice, who just whose parents don't know their rights and to go back into the school system and, uh, and defend them with more power and with my legal expertise.